Hey, howdy everyone! Lost Lady here, back in action for more post-game attraction! That's right, we have Gita here, and she needs to tell us something very important. Gita, what do you have to say? Good day, Champion Lost. Now tell me, what do you think of, your, of our entrance hall? Do you enjoy being surrounded by books? Yeah, I do. That's good to hear. It was renovated a few years ago, and I was the one who came up with the new design. But more importantly, I would very much like to hear your report on the gym method. Hmm. Now that I think about it, this location is perhaps a little too public. Do you know of anywhere quiet where we might be able to discuss things a bit more discreetly? Don't tell me that we're in, we're in my room. We are! Uh oh, you just in my room. Kind of hot. But this is the dorm room uh, where you live. I wonder, is this room what helped nurture your potential as a champion? No. Oh wait, I remember it now. You only recently moved into the dormitories. In the near future, perhaps I'll pay your family's home a visit. If I may. Oh no! Gita's gonna fuck my mom! And again. Hot new stepmom. Wait a minute. Anyway. Let us uh, get to the topic at hand. I would very much like to hear your report now. That you've inspected the gym later. Tell me. Which gym leader did you feel was the easiest to face in battle? The easiest one I had to face in battle, I'd probably say, uh, Crusha? Tulip wasn't. Tulip was, was very, was, was a struggle. Rhyme was a bit of a struggle, but Crusha wasn't. Larry had some struggles. Even Katie, like, she caught me off brand. Kofu, I forget who Kofu, yeah, Kofu is the, the water dude. I do feel like Crusha is just generally underwhelming. As much as I like him. Crusha, you say? Next, which gym leader left the strongest impression on you? I don't know. Either Tulip, Larry, or Kate. It's either Tulip or Kate. I'm gonna be real. I want to say Tulip did, because Tulip is just fairly interesting as a gym leader. Tulip, I would have to agree. Then which gym leader gave you the most trouble during the battle? The most trouble? Crack, dude, I can't remember everything. Uh, it's either Tulip, which I was under leveled to face her, or Larry, which I believe is the case. But I know one of these mother truckers, I, I did have the least amount. Maybe Crusha was? I don't think so, though. I'm pretty sure I nailed that bitch. So I'm gonna say Larry's the one that actually gave me the most trouble. Larry, I see. Next is the last most important question. Which gym leader do you like the most? Do I like the most? So, it's definitely gonna be, like, one of the girls, but I I do like Crusha. Crusha, Tulip, Kate, and Eno are all 100% on brand. Full targets. Let's go. Eno, I feel like, doesn't get enough things. Kate had an interesting going back to. Uh, Eno has an interesting little thing. She has a little interesting little thing. Crusha is pretty interesting. Uh, Larry's fairly neat, but I don't think Rhythm, Rhyme was the case. Maybe I should have said Rhyme was the easiest, because I think that was the case that Rhyme was actually the easiest. Hmm. But what gym leader do I like the most? I wouldn't say Tulip. I would not say Tulip. Tulip is interesting, but Crusha, Eno, Larry, or Kate... I want to put Kate up there. She has a wonderful design and everything. I like her a bunch, but no. 
This is Eno, Larry, or Crusha? Uh, despite everything, I do think Crush is the coolest one. But I definitely do think that Ice probably should have been, like, a little bit earlier. In terms of things, if I'm gonna be real. Uh... I like Eno's design a lot, too, though. Larry is an interesting character, par none. Like, one of the best male Pokemons, for sure. But... Eno or Crusha would be it then. So I like Crusha a lot. I was the most excited to face him. And he has a fairly interesting bit. I'm gonna say Crusha. Crusha, you say? Those are all the questions I have. Thank you very much for your help on this. Your perspective was fascinating, Champion Moss. I have no doubt it'll assist me when running the organization. Please accept this as thanks. The King's Rock? Um, cool. Thanks to you, my schedule has cleared up quite significantly. So I will most definitely be joining the tournament we discussed in a director's office. I'm sure Champion Nomona would be pleased too. Well, thanks for letting me visit. I should be, uh, get back to work now. You must be tired. I suggest you take it easy for the rest of the day. He's so pretty and has big hair. It's just kind of ridiculous, really. I really wish that we gotten more to do with the dorm here. Like, there definitely was an ability to, like, you could get, like, plushies here and things like that, but they just didn't do that. Like, that's what makes me sad the most about these dorms. Like, it could have been something neat. And they just didn't. One week later, thanks to Mimona's pushing and a bit of cooperation from the Pokemon League, the day finally arrived for the great Pokemon battle competition to be held. Cool? Really? Hey, Lost! <laughs> I'm so glad we just managed to get everything ready for the Academy Ace Tournament! Oh, yeah! That's when we decided to officially name the tournament. It's a good name, right? Fitting or memorable? And then Irvin uh, went and said we should call it School Battle Brawl. And even Director Calvin got into calling it that. So now I'm just like, ugh. Anyway, how you feeling, Lost? In the mindset to do some winning? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> That's the enthusiasm. Show us what a champion's made of. So uh, cool that Laprima is uh, going to make a guest appearance. Let's see your hard work. I wish I didn't have my hands full of all the behind-the-scenes admin stuff. I don't even get to do an, uh, any battling myself. But I'll seize the chance to do uh, some objective research into what makes you so good. <laughs> anyway, let's get going. I'll meet you in the front desk at the entry hall. No stalling. For sure, no stall. Head to the entrance hall. See you. But first, we do need to figure out a few things here. I'm trying to think about it in terms of what we have here. But I think I'm going to get rid of these, these items here. These two are fine. I like what they have. But I definitely think we could do better. So for now, give me a moment. There we go. I went ahead and just changed a little bit of everything uh, in terms of levels. They're all around 70, if not a little bit more. Rouse Down downward being kind of the, the go-to for the rest of it, so kind of surprised he's the one. But everybody else should be pretty good. Polar, I had no idea what to put on them, but they are a legendary, and you know what? This is a good way to make money, so I put an Amulet coin. But he's going to be my lead. Let's go. Let's go to the entrance hall. It's time to start tournament arc! <laughs> it's basically just Elite Four again, right? There you are, Lost. You gotta go uh, go through the application process with the staffer before you actually participate uh, in the tournament. Uh, ready for the explanation now, mister? Alright, the rules of the Academy uh, Ace of Tournament are as follows. 
Any student or faculty member of the Academy may enter. Your opponents will be random, and only winners will advance the next round. Opponents will be matched by lottery, and the lottery is run by the people in charge. That means you have no idea who you'll be facing until we meet uh, them on the battle court. Winners, uh, as I said, will get to advance the next round. But lose once, and you're knocked out. No more battles for you after that. Last trainer standing, the only person to win all their matches will be deemed the best of all. The Academy's ace! Thanks very much! We hashed out the tournament rules with uh, help from Director uh, Calvin. Based on the number of entries so far, you probably have to win four times to take it all. Don't forget you might go up against the facility too. They're tough stuff. So good luck! And go be uh, even stronger. The only person allowed to beat me is you! Please uh, talk to me when you're ready to take uh, part. I mean, honestly, better late than never, right? It's the only thing we really have left to go. And that's really it for post game, I think. As much as it was fun to join this little thing and do its little bits, uh, definitely feels slightly shorter than uh, Sword and Shield, but far more enjoyable, I'm gonna be real. <laughs> Alright, cool. Yes, let's do this thing. Yeah, I'm a champion rank trainer. I should hopefully have all my good things set. Hopefully. If I've been a very good girl. Excellent. It seems everyone is here. Some of you will certainly have heard the happy news. We have a new champion here at Narja Academy. Yes, none other than our very own Miss Lost. For real? That's amazing. Bueno, uh, it's your, uh, <laughs> mucha. Fuck. Oh, that's terrible. Fuck, I butchered. I butchered the Mexicanese language. Holy shit, dude. I'm so bad at Spanish, fam. Whoa. Way to go, champion. Gives me great joy to see one of our students achieve this feat during their time at the Academy. Today's tournament was organized by your student council president, Miss Nimona. In celebration of a friend's accomplishment, I invite all of you here to see for yourselves the impressive strength of our new champion. Not to mention the talents of those students claiming the spotlight for the first time today. And of course, the suburb battle paralysis and a tomb of our Steam's as faculty. Now without further ado, let the Academy Ace Tournament, our school battle brawl, begin! Alright, let's just uh, jump right into the first round, everyone. Duel the Fates of Para today. Champion Loss will be facing Arvin uh, from Class 2G. You've got to be kidding me. Up against my little champion uh, buddy right from the first round. So how about it, Lost? Bet you're surprised to see me in this tournament, right? No, not really. Wait, you actually thought I would sign up for this thing. I guess you really do get me. No wonder we're best buds! See, when we get went down to Area Zero, it really drove home for me how I need to get stronger. So I've been off doing some special super serious training with Mobastiff and my team. And we've even ended up in trouble again. I want to be there fighting beside you, on the same level! Today, I'm here to win! Even it might only be by a stroke of luck. Get a taste of this. Arvin's here for some spicy new flavor for you. Oh, he's pumped. Whoop. Greedent. Now don't be greedy. Because I'm about to be peedy. I want you and me to be on the same level. So I'm going after this win without a holding back. Yeah, well, I'm going after you dying, so to just so you can just die. Shabam! Oh wow, yeah, that 
Cut through them like glass. Uh, Garganok? I don't know what Garganok is. That feels like a new Pokemon, but I have no idea. Rushes are most all around her person, so hopefully. What is that thing? Gargon Ulk. Oh! It's a rock! I want to do Leaf Blade because I don't get to do it, but we want to make sure this thing's dead. Gosh. Yeah, that's fine. A Toad Scroll? That's a grass ground, right? Oh, grass ground? Oh, baby. Oh. <laughs> I feel bad for Arvin because we're just using all of our, um, how to say, ones he could find in Legends and the Paradox. So he's just kind of getting it again. So this is death for you, I'm pretty sure. Oh no. Oh no, I didn't expect that. Spore! Oh no! It got me! Uh... I don't know if I really want to be doing anything, but... Sure. We have nothing else to really do here. What are you doing this time, bud? Power Whip? Oof. I'm glad he could take something. Come on, High School Garage. Please do it this time. There you go. Gosh. Skull of Villain. So that's a Grass Fire? So this will hit for neutral. But we could just do a poison, right? Poison will just kill. Um, yeah. Bronze Dower is about to show him. The bam. I do not like this dastard. He looks so fugly. Bunk shot! Oh no. I miss. What? Oh, it's super effective! Oh no! That's not great. Dude! I missed again! Ah! Rouse Tower, get out of there! Get out of the lava! Three misses in a row! Please, Rouse Tower! You gotta do it! No! No! Four misses in a row! Rouse Tower! Oh, this punk ass. Nah, you were about to die for real. For real. Yeah, it does have grass, but we should be fine. So, first things first. Oh fuck, I forgot! And it's super effective too. That's not great. You dastard. You dastard! You really went ahead on this, didn't ya? I'll get you. Slowly but surely, inch by inch. What you did to Rouse Tower? No, thank you. Sorry, bud. It can happen. Not today. Thank you for the free heals! We all like to thank you for this opportunity to heal as you slowly die. <laughs> yeah, I know what you're trying to do, bubs. You know what? Well, then again, it is also fire. Hmm. 
It's also fire, so should we go to grass? Because we will take times two damage regardless of the fact. Oh, sorry. Not gonna take it today. No Zen Hun button. Not today. And slowly but surely, I see you doing. Go down. We could just recover this. That will work for me. Ho ho! This is what you get for all those times that you did to Rousedower. Missing every time! Terrible! Loister! Loister then. We got Rush here. Goes into Fairy. Um. Yeah, we'll get us go ahead and hit Redundant. That's fine. We might be able to get Ancient Power on this. We'll hit it well. I'm really surprised at the choice this year. So, we have Super Effective for Thunderbolt. I didn't even realize that I had that. I was thinking more Ancient Power Sweep. Oh, that did a lot, too. Yo, let's go! The sweep! The sweep is real! Can we get much higher? It means nothing to me. The sweep is real. Ah! Let's go! Retribution! The way things go, my little tiny angel redundant, Momo. <laughs> Mubostif. Mubostif means nothing to me. Putting everything I caught into this. No regrets allowed. No letters after this meal. Yeah, I see you. I hear you. And I, I don't exactly do that other stuff, so... Thunderbolt. Let's light up the school battle brawl. Mubostif! Brighter than anyone! What are you doing with this time, bubs? Ink. Ink, you little food. We have a sweep, though. The sweep is real! Let's put those great jaws to good use, bud. We're gonna chew up uh, hopes of victory. Oh. That was just rude now, wasn't it? Well, we're not gonna do that. We'll just do it again. Thunderbolt! Ah, so close! No! 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 Redundant! My poor baby. You do this to me. Well. Hmm. Let's double we'll make sure that you get to pay for this. Sorry, bubs. But looks like your day is ruined. Ha ha! Sacred sword, go now! Done. Put that puppy down. So strong and cool. Real proud to call you my best friend, you know. And I'm proud to call you Money Pit. The winner of the first round battle is Champion Lost. Woo! Alright! Treasure's Kid, I put up a heck of a fight! 
get a spicy start, and that's only the first match. Phew. The streak of the champion is legit. It hurts to lose, but I'm proud of you, little bud. Maybe I should uh, think about going around to all those gyms myself sometime. You better try just as hard as I would have uh, in round two for me. Oh, we're going to the next one immediately. Oh, so this is just like completely... I hear you uh, went to your a treasure hunt uh, and wound up becoming a champion. That's quite the achievement. I guess I'm the homeroom teacher for uh, two champion ranked students now. Won't lie, I'm feeling a wee bit of pressure here. I got to work hard so my students don't outshine me too much, huh? Well then, let's get started, shall we? Here's hoping I do okay. So we don't get a break. This isn't like the Elite Four. You don't get breaks. We're just straight up at it. Arcanine. Oh, that's not great. Show me what you've got in your own way and at your own pace. Okay, that's cool and all, but we need to leave. Thankfully, that doesn't really bother me so much. Oh, everyone's healed up. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness that is the case. Then now we can just process things. But we should still do this instead. I don't think you can learn any thunder type moves, so we should be fine on that situation. Oh, you went out. You want to try that again, bud? Gimme, gimme, gimme. Did, did, did you want to try that again? It's all water pulse. Ah, why do you have things? I don't think that can flinch, thankfully, so we should be fine. Yes! Mm. Now I don't know what I want to do, though. What do I want to do? I could stay in, or I could switch to someone better. It has Flare Blitz, and it has Psychic, and if we do take damage from Psychic, this will be fine. I don't think it has anything that we could go against. It might have Crunch. It's a possibility it has Crunch. Well, no, we wouldn't have to deal with it. Okay, that's fine. We're, we're, we're switching to Venestra. We can't completely wall it, and we have our, our go out. Wanna try this again? That does nothing to me. Idiot. So it probably has Flare Blitz. Let's just Thunder Wave it, so... What? What? Oh. Thankfully, it does get hurt twice over from shit, so we're pretty good. I can literally just Thunder Wave it and just hope for the best there. Because I don't think I have enough to actually kill it. Arcanine is surprisingly pretty beefy. Um, but we should have enough just to outlive it from this. Because it gets hit by both things. So now it's done. I was hoping to paralyze it and then do the thing, but this whatever. Mudsdale. That's a ground. I think it's just a solid ground. Thankfully, we do have this on our feet. Rush, you are for us. Let's go. Now you're doing this? All right, we played it is. Oh no, we can die. That's not good. We can die. Ah! Oh yeah, let's go, Rush. Let's go. Uh, good blast, I guess. I'm sad because Rush will die from this. We have Life Orb on it, and it just isn't going to happen. 
his fate. Thank you, Rush. Polar should be fine. Polar should be able to get this just fine. Cool. Grass bug, I got you. So... Yeah, we'll just do that. Yes! Ultimate death! Push to slow bro. Slow bro. It does have psychic, and that's a problem. But we do have dark. We could just switch to dark. I don't know what else it would have, to be honest. I think we're good if we just do everything the way that it needs to be done. How many do you have left? He has three. I mean, I don't think I'll be able to kill it. I don't think Slowbro would have a fighting. He probably wouldn't do a curse set. It'd probably be something else. You know what? Let's risk the biscuit. Polar, show up. Show him what you're made of. The good stuff, that is. My boy. Yes, that's what I needed. Philosophically. One hit KO. A small lot? That's uh, poison. We should be fine. We actually do have something for this. Believe it or not. But, small I believe is a physical. Uh, no, they're a special defense. Oh, bitch! You should have been muck! Dumbass! Ha <laughs> Show me your ace in the hole, bud. This polar got the opposite on you. Raverick. Oh, buddy. Oh, you sure are strong. Is that some secret in the way you raise your Pokemon? But we'll just see, right? Raverick. Welcome to my Night Slash. This little energy, and there you have it. Now watch as my Pokemon tetralizes. Into what? If it's psychic, we're good. We got this bitch. But if it's not, I'm a little scared. Because that could actually live. Yes! You are my bitch! Ha <laughs> You stupid idiot! Dark beat psychic! Every day of the week. Done. You're done! You were a bye to me, that's what you were. Well, you did great! Yes, we have won the second round. <laughs> you beat me. You're a quite strong uh, trainer, aren't you, Lost? You're more fit uh, for the teaching profession than I am with the boundless confidence of yours. Mr. Jacques, did I hear you correctly just now? Uh-oh. Uh. -oh. uh. Hi, Director. Are you angry with me? <laughs> well, I'm going to go uh, get yelled at. Uh, good luck in the coming battle. So he just gets yelled at for free, aight? 